Hey Elvis, what's the story? Hey Elvis, what's the story? I've been getting hundreds of emails that seem to say the same thing. This one's from Lucy from Baton Rouge, Louisiana. Lucy says, I'm electronically plugged in from early morning till late at night. Don't get me wrong, this makes me happy. I spend my days blogging, texting, surfing the web, work on the computer at work. The problem is, when I stop, when I'm ready to go to bed, I start to sweat. I get anxiety attacks. I shake. I shake. I don't know what to do. Is there something seriously wrong with my brain? Time out, Lucy. Time out. You need some R&R. &R. You need to let the rational mind rest. Your mind is on vacation, but your mouth is working overtime. Let me tell you a story. There was a farmer, a very old man, who lived in the mountains. He had arthritis, it was hard to do the chores. One day, he goes into town for groceries, and as he's shopping, he hears this horrible racket in the back room. Woo, woo, he looks inside, and he sees a little green man. Looks like a frog, got bumps all over him. He's mad as hell, and he's rattling his cage. He says to the owner, my God, what is that thing? The owner says, that is the rational mind, and it's for sale if you want to buy it. What does it do? The farmer said. The rational mind will do anything you say. If you give it a list, he will accomplish everything on that list. The problem is that you must never give him free time. You must never let him function without something to do. The farmer buys the rational mind and takes it home. The next morning, he gives it a long list of chores. Chop the wood plow the South 40, build a fire, sweep the floor, and the farmer falls asleep. When he awakes, everything is clean, everything is done. The farmer is very, very pleased. The next day, the farmer wakes up, gives the rational mind the list, and goes into town. He meets an old friend. They have a beer. Time passes quickly. He forgets. He looks at his watch and realizes the list he gave the rational mind must have run out at least an hour ago. Whoa, 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 whoa. Panicked, he starts running home. As he runs up the hill, he sees fire shooting out of the windows of his farmhouse. My God, he says. The rational mind has set my house on fire. As he runs in the door, he sees that the rational mind has collected all the children in the neighborhood, put them on skewers. Whoa, whoa, Lord have mercy. And is roasting their bodies over the open flame. Unplug, Lucy. Unplug and do it now.